Yo, what's happening? YouTube Jugger here. Welcome back to another video. Now, I know a lot of Tiny Tina gameplay has been out in the last week, week and a half. And we have Tiny Tina reveal, actual release here in about another two weeks. And I'm super excited before I give you guys my thoughts and how I feel about this game for what I've seen from all of the creators and the stream team from the Borderlands team. Um, this is a re-upload from Jolts. You guys already know Jolts do. Shout out to Jolts. Um, this is his gameplay. And I just want to focus on a couple of things in this video. First of all, everything I've seen is just super amazing. The creativity, the beautiful graphics, the gameplay. Uh, everything just looks super just colorful and vibrant. I love how it just brings beauty to the eye and the mechanics and the gameplay everything just comes together so beautiful i really hope that they have everlasting rarity in this game i know they have everlasting items but hopefully i know they're saying that it's not in the game for now but you never know with dlc add-ons which i'm super excited for the new seasons coming to this game so if you are gonna buy this game i highly suggest please get the season pass because you're gonna want all of those gold armor that comes with the uh, legendary edition, whatever it's called, the highest edition, digital edition, whatever it is. Get the highest one. I think it's seventy nine ninety nine eighty dollars. I do have it. Um, I have it for PC, Xbox, PlayStation, every single where because you guys already know what I do, <laughs> and I cannot wait um, to bring that to you. I don't. I don't want to you know say it out loud, but you guys already know what time it is when you know it time and the time comes. For it to be revealed, you know, you guys know where to get your stuff from. But um, not concentrating on that right now, but you guys know that is coming soon. Um, yes, I know you guys are super excited. I'm super excited to be back for you guys as we reopen a certain something online and start, you know, doing something for you guys. is going to be great, and I'm super excited. Um, don't forget to follow me on my Discord. Um, I will be posting updates here couple of days before the game actually drops on where we are and give you guys updates on um, what are we going to do along the way. Same thing like before, but better and more rewards, more loot points and everything for you guys. So you guys can always get free content. Now, I do love the melee aspect of this game. You guys know I've been screaming about it for the last three years, Borderlands 3. Um, I just really want melee and I'm super happy to see melee in this game and it plays a vital role. Um, look at this. I mean, look at this beautiful scythe right here. Look at just, oh, I can't wait to get my hands on this and, you know, play around with it and bring you guys something extra special for you guys to have more fun in this game. But it just looks super just amazing. And I really wanted melee and the simple fact that they have their own slot for it makes it even more worthwhile and special. I love the spells. I love that it takes hold of grenades. I think that's a very beautiful addition. I know Jolts um, said in this video, I think particularly, or maybe the quality of life update video, that um, he doesn't like that the character, when you go into the character selection screen and you actually go into your bag and loot and change out inventory and stuff like that, he doesn't like that a character takes up you know, majority of the screen, and I think that's beautiful because one thing about this game in particular, other than Borderlands 3, is that customization of the characters play a higher important role, and I think it's beautiful that you see a character in such a full, glamorous, you know, takes up two-thirds of the screen, screen, sorry, because it actually shows you, you know, when you get your DLC, you know, gold armor, you're going to want to shine, and you're going to want to see it in full, and it just thinks it's a beautiful idea that the developers did go that route. I know Joe's don't like it right now, but I'm pretty sure it will grow on him as he unlocks more armor because his armor drops in this game, and your character really does, you know, shine bright <laughs> like a diamond, and I really do love everything that I'm seeing I, I mean, look at the vending machines. They just look really creative, super fun. Everything just about this game screams fun and creates creativity, and that's all that matters to me. And you guys know since I had my, you know, shop, you know, back then, still have it. It's just, you know, we're waiting for the time to actually start it again, which will be very shortly, very soon. And I'm super excited for that as well. And everything just is coming together and hopefully you guys pre-order this game and game content. We're not sure what it looks like right now, but you guys don't have to worry about that because you got me. And um, I mean, look at it. The slot for the melee weapon just looks great. I'm not sure which character I'm going to pick to start out with. 
you guys know I will play with every character, all six of them. I will be playing with probably Graveborn looks really fun to me so far. Spudshot looks cool, but I do love all of them right now just for what I'm seeing. Haven't played with them yet, so playing mechanics, gameplay will be different as, you know, I go through them, but I'm pretty sure I'm going to love them all. But let me know in the comment section what you guys think about this game, what you guys seen so far. You guys loving what you've seen. You guys pre-order. You guys excited. You guys excited for the shop to come back. Like, let me know because I'm really involved with you guys and, you know, we are here for you guys, and we are super excited to get back into it. So until next time, remember, treat yourself. Don't cheat yourself. I'm Jugs. You guys soon in two weeks. And, of course, I'll be playing with majority of you as we go. Peace.